add to a one piece. feel better or worse. I forgot to ask for Chick-fil-A sauce. <laughs> That's like the best part. Yeah. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. I ordered some Chick-fil-A today. I have the worst cramps of my life right now. And I was talking to my friend on the phone and we have plans tonight. So I'm hoping that I feel better. Hydrated and bouncy. It feels amazing. I'm gonna go in with this toner. I actually haven't used it in a while But my skincare I try to keep as simple as possible and sometimes add in different products It just depends on the day. Also a lot of the products I get are from Yes I have a huge skincare haul that I want to show you guys too. I usually use this one and this one you guys have seen a lot it's the uh, time revolution essence now my skin is like so much more bouncy and i haven't even put moisturizer yet probably might be my favorite moisturizer forever until i find a new one it's the curology one not even sponsored at all i've been using it for two years actually i got it in 2021 to be honest my skin has been a little too dry for this moisturizer but it's just a safe moisturizer for me i know it won't break me out on nights where i use treatment or acids i do use the neutrogena gel cream extra dry one this is kind of expensive for drugstore so if you do have a costco i got this two for one i do have dry skin but i'm normally not a fan of cream consistencies and i know that gel is mostly for oily skin but it feels like cream moisturizers just sit on my skin and the last step of my routine is sunscreen and i put a a very generous amount i actually did get a refill of this too because i don't want it to run out i think i might have put a little too much but no there's such thing as too much sunscreen i feel and i put it at the backs of my hands too and my neck and my ears i was told once a few years ago that the most common place to get melanoma is on your ears so i always put sunscreen on my ears and i feel like this gives a white cast for only a second but then it goes away maybe it's too glowy but i love it i feel like it's literally glass skin the sunscreen is the reason for my like shiny oily 
glassy skin and now i'm going to get it out of my pjs because my new year's resolution is actually to not lounge in pjs all day because then i will just stay in bed all day We have all of this to put away today. There's like piles, like there's so much. It doesn't look like that much. This is weeks worth of socks. So I'm gonna put all of this away. Might take me a while and I'm pretty sure it will take me a while. Not even might, this is gonna take me a minute. have a haul a very big haul that's been accumulating for the past week i think um some is pr and some are things that i bought myself i'm gonna go ahead with the things i bought first i ordered from glass ons first really wanted a workout kind of um zip up the quality of this is so buttery and i think i got this for 30 dollars and it definitely feels more expensive than it is and then i got two more things from their website there's this onesie kind of piece been trending like crazy and i love it these are things i love to wear it's a one piece but the back is open and it's almost off the shoulders i ordered a small slash us4 because of my height but i'm gonna be honest it does run a little big at least it kind of was falling off my shoulders when i first tried it on this color had just come out and normally i would never wear this color but you guys come on this is so cute i just had to it's a little big so i'm hoping it shrinks a little in the wash i went to airy with my mom and i got these tops the material is crazy it's double lined so it won't be see-through or anything and i love that it's like racer back and i also got it in white because these are like tops that i love to wear i got both these in a small i posted this on an instagram but i got some pieces from this brand called foundationals it's la based i believe and maybe women owned as well it's the classic tank this one is like a longer tank and you guys know i love basic pieces like this um and then they sent me the easy does it tank and it's like a little thicker um and shorter and it matches the waffle knit pants that they sent me i also made myself a little coffee it's a lot sweeter than i would normally make it but and then i got this big box from this style oh wait i forgot i also ordered these beanies from amazon they look like normal beanies but they have fleece inside they have really sensitive skin so beanies feel really itchy to me this one is so soft the only sad part is that this is supposed to be green this is pretty much borderline gray so that was upsetting i only ordered this bundle because i wanted the green one onto the yes out haul i don't really wear baby tanks anymore but i love wearing them when i'm like running errands and stuff so i got this little um sheep crop top i'm going on a really exciting trip at the end of march so I got this. I don't know if this will look good on me, so we're gonna try it. No! Um, I got this kind of, what's it called, like straight top. I need to stop picking things out that are black, but it's my comfort color. I feel like it always looks nice. I got this long sleeve. Wow, this is a lot softer than I thought. I got this tote bag. It says bookshop. That is adorable. I also got this shrug that I've been wanting for so long. It's always a top pick on Anya style. And they're really cute to wear with tanks and it's perfect for spring coming up. I got a green beanie, but don't think this is going to fit my head. And let me roll it for reference. 
yeah i got a refill of the beauty by Josian. i also got the miso one it's always been a favorite but this one is kind of winning the game recently and this look how cute that is so you get to try their famous products in like little serums heard so many good things about this xsy brand the dark spot glow correcting serum when i went to korea i learned about the whole game of meta heal these are some of the best face masks so i had to bunch up and get two i got this cleansing oil that i actually haven't used in a long time i've been using the hadalabo one i got some more dr jart face masks also been hearing so many good things about this brand i got the toner the skin softening serum and the deep sleep mask and then this used to be a brand i used a lot in 2020 i got some squalene oil from timeless and also their vitamin c serum so excited to try these things because a lot of these things have been so highly spoken about so today i plan on having a kind of home buddy day i kind of just want to stay in and regenerate and recuperate after the weekend i feel like sometimes when i feel like this i need to let my body recuperate i just use these uh sheet things that I got from Korea. It's so sad because I found out that they don't have it here. I don't know why it didn't click because I've never seen the product before in the US, but it's like a brand that I've seen in the US. I was like, oh, maybe it's new. But no, it's just a Korean product that doesn't exist here. I did download a few Switch games, so I think I'm entering my Stardew era right now, which is very exciting, but also scary because when Animal Crossing came out, I was stuck. I downloaded it only after I finished the semester because it came out like right when the pandemic started and my semester ended in april and i had a two-week break before starting orgo and in those two weeks i got i think 200 or 300 hours of playtime i just i'm such a cozy gamer i don't know how i even started playing valorant i've always been more of like a movie star planet type girl and like webkins i played fortnite on my phone when it like was getting popular so the fact that i'm like into pc gaming is like crazy now. I just got these from Yes Style and I'm using Numbuzzin. I use this new serum. It's skin softening. So like you got me. That's exactly what I want for my skin. I love Sims. The fact that it's free now is absurd to me because I paid the $40 or $50 or when it first came out. This kind of feels almost oily so I'm not sure. I do want to exercise today so I would love to do a walk and walk my dog but it's very hot out and I obviously don't want my dog to overheat. Ooh. 